Hello! Scrub those curtains really clean here today and I'm back to do another reaction to MLP this time, Season 7, Episode 9. And I have no idea why I'm talking like this, but let's get reacting in 3, 2, 1 and go. A poster. Helping me with these flyers, Spike. Spike would help you with anything. So lucky you just happen to be walking past the boutique. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, right. I just happen to be walking past. <laughs> <laughs> he was spying on you. Another poster. What you got here? Lost dogs, balloons for sale, guitar lessons. Because I found one, I need some, and yes, I am interested. Wait, what are you? <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> All right it's then. Cold submissions fashion contest I'm organizing a showcase for aspiring young designers oh, wow. why are you Wait, keeping that in your main thank you I suppose there where's the rest of the post is to break into the fashion industry when I was starting out that's why the winner of the contest will get to debut their line in the carousel boutique Ooh. so selfless <laughs> so generous Spike. I've also managed to get esteemed fashion critic Hoity Toity <laughs> oh, and God. iconic fashion Hoity photographer Photo Finish <laughs> to come to Ponyville and judge the show. And <laughs> wait until you hear who else will be a judge. Hey. Countess Coritura? Sassy Saddles? Spike? <laughs> no. <laughs> the third judge for the Carousel Boutique's Couture de Futur Fashion Contest yes. is none other than Applejack! <laughs> what? <laughs> What? What? <laughs> of all the ponies? <laughs> Why her? She knows about as much as fashion as you do in apple bucket when drunk. Or dressing up as a farmer, which is a callback to another episode. She's about as useful as a... No, actually. She could be a porn star. I have said this in many episodes. It's a whole new meaning to count. Yeah. Anyway. <clears throat> Meanwhile. What? You already said that. Oh right. I know, but I had to say it again because that's how confused I am. You want me to judge a fashion show? Yeah. I'm sure Verity has her reasons, and once we hear them, all of this How many times did you drop those I now, admit, Spike? Applejack is an unorthodox choice, but that is precisely what makes her an inspired choice. Okay. See? Know it all! What? Still doesn't make any sense. Oh, okay. Pointy Toity has expertise in fabric and stitch work. Photo Finish has an artistic eye for shapes and colors. But sometimes we designers forget about practicality. That's where you come ah. in. Uh, I think I might be a little too practical. <laughs> My closet's nothing but 20 versions of this hat. <laughs> 20 Which versions of this pony. hat. Who knows what she likes? Besides, a judge must be honest. And you're the most honest pony there is. Literally. Ask any pony, they'll tell you. Oh, oh, let me <laughs> Excuse me, have you ever heard of Applejack? The most honest pony there is? Sure have. Wow, that was a nice on cue response. So, what do you say? Well, if I'm being honest, I don't think I'm the right pony for the job. Fashion just ain't my bag of oats. <laughs> <laughs> Pinky pie. I do understand your hesitation, Boom. but before you say no, sleep on it? Sure. I guess I can do that for you. <laughs> Let me get back to my apples. <clears throat> oh, that guy. <laughs> you could have just done that. Yeah, I know, Big Mac. I was just as surprised as you all. I mean, can you imagine <sighs> me judging a fashion show? <laughs> What's what that it's look? It's not good getting to see all those pretty outfits. Well, you're the exception in our family, Sugar Cube. You know about that kind of stuff. I'd be as useful as a bird knot on a sapling tree. Yeah, whatever that <laughs> euphemism was. <laughs> Although, Rarity did say I just had to focus on practicality. She already has experts for the fashion-y stuff. Yeah. yeah. But I still wouldn't know what to say. Uh, what? That's not practical for starters. Come on, Apple Bloom. You're doubling our workload here. Sorry. I wanted to wear a signature hat like yours, but it's making it harder to see. <laughs> That's because it's not like mine. <laughs> You don't need a fancy scarf to keep your hat on. Now you can see. Yep. 
practicality. Wow, that is a lot better. <laughs> Thanks, Applejack. Sure thing. Ah, see, yeah, you got it. I am gonna help Rarity judge her show. I think my sensible every pony take on fashion is exactly what the pony community needs. Rarity, I thought about it some more, and if you're still some more, me, I'd love to be a judge. Oh, clap, 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 clap. I just clap. knew you'd come around. Come around. I, photo finish, I, have arrived. This has been a while since we've uh, seen these ponies. Oh, well, wonderful to see. I go. Kiss, kiss, so kiss. For doing this. Stop it. We missed you at Miss Pomel's debut in Manhattan last week. Miss Pomel is showing? I thought she was still making costumes. You haven't heard? Every pony who is every <laughs> pony is talking about it. Oh. Okay. Oh my, they're absolutely stunning. It sure is great to hear Miss Pomel is doing so well. <laughs> who is this who speaks? <laughs> Oh, uh, this is Applejack, another one of the judges. So, Judge, what do you think? <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, well, uh, okay. That is just wow. These are clothes? The photo is upside down. <laughs> this is. She looks like a disco ball. <laughs> Did they have to roll her down the runway? <laughs> I can't believe any pony would actually wear this. <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> oh, oh, my! I faint! <laughs> <laughs> what are you wanted her? Are you, you can't complain. You said you wanted someone honest. Oh, gosh. I didn't mean to make her faint. She's just overdramatic. Oh, don't worry about it, darling. Uh, it happens all the time. It does? Oh, yeah. Besides, <laughs> yes, what? Just like a disco ball. Although, Miss Pomel is making the point that no matter what we wear, it is a costume of some kind or another. Yeah, but... I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> and that's okay. Let's go meet the designers and help them get ready for the show. Designers! <laughs> oh, my, oh, my Today, days. Work on your design, the main design. We judges will offer our guidance and advice as you prepare for tomorrow's big show. Uh, I like I like the veins. They're very nice. Lily Lace, tell us about your inspiration. Yes. It's like, you got it. It's like Gordon Ramsay's uh, I heard a bird Hell Kitchen. Literally the most beautiful song I'd ever heard, and I wanted to capture not so much the bird's song uh, exactly, the accent. but more like how the wind carried the bird's song. Powerful yet at the same time fragile and delicate. Uh, what does Apple think of it? Uh. Next up, meet Starstreak. Starstreak. <sighs> I'm not interested in what's already been done. Uh, Only what we aren't you? In the future. <laughs> mm, tomorrow's fashion belongs to those who hear it coming. <laughs> and Applejack is just. I am Inky Rose. Inky Rose. I'm an emo kid. You have a very focused mission. A strong sense of what you want, it's good! Yeah. Applejack, you've been rather quiet. What do you think? It, what, what do you think? Well, That's practical. It's a lot of black. It's kind of depressing. <laughs> do you want to go and tell more, Dad? How's that? <laughs> Makes a world of difference. Just more Maybe black. Maybe to fashion experts like you, but to ponies like me, it's still black. <gasps> and uh, I'm not sure how you wear singing birds or the future. <laughs> I, I'm sorry, I'm quiet. I just have no idea what to say. I don't say. think they liked what I had to say. Oh, well, that's why you're here. Fashion needs a healthy dose of practicality now and then. Okay. Really? Are you putting holes in the clothes on purpose? It's to create a distressed look. More like an old and tattered look. <laughs> when a pony's only clothes with holes in them, they don't want to go to the exactly, store to buy new clothes okay. with holes in them. Okay, I have to agree here. Very practical um, there are places that sell ripped jackets. jeans. Now, what is the point in that? If I want to rip a pair of jeans, I'll just cut myself. Simply I'm not going to pay for it. Sure, it looks pretty, but that's a lot of fabric. With the way it drags behind, it'll be covered in dirt in no time. 
Thank goodness I'm here. Otherwise, we'd have had holes in clothes and dirty dishes. <laughs> I, I, I'm not seeing anything wrong here. <laughs> well, of course, no look is complete without mane and makeup. So, uh, when are you gonna do her mane? <laughs> oh, it's already been done. It has? You know what? It doesn't look like uh, it. I think we've given the designers enough guidance for today. Let's, uh, let them finish their work. I, 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 I know. See what y'all do for the big show tomorrow. I'm personally with Applejack here. <laughs> Really, Pinkie Pie? Hey, Applejack! On your way home, how'd the first day of the contest go? <laughs> Great! At first, I didn't think I'd be much help, but thank goodness I signed on. Without me, they'd be doing all kinds of crazy, fashiony <laughs> things. Yeah? Hey, Rarity! Applejack says the contest is going great! Good thing Why did you have a two-string guitar? Yes, of course. Some of her thoughts are tough to swallow. But hopefully her candor will help the designers achieve the best designs possible. You seem a little stressed. Wanna try? <laughs> Music is very relaxing. No. Sure. Mm. Oh! What? Much better. What was Time for final adjustments before the show. Oh, if buttons could convey sadness, you've done it. To me, they convey waking up an hour early just to button them all, and that's if you could reach most of them. Um, okay, that's it, wasn't that bad. Okay, is this better? Better, there you go. Now, Isn't that called, exactly how you started off with? You're set. Like a poncho. A poncho? Um, poncho. Oh, poncho. <laughs> Every feather makes a difference. I attached each feather individually. <laughs> it took me for literally ever. <laughs> <laughs> for literally ever. Oh, you used hoof cross double over stitches. Oh, they're perfect. Who cares if it's stitched perfectly? You don't need feathers on your head. Oh. Yes. <laughs> I guess. My little sister tried to add some flair to her hat, and guess what it got her? An extra hour of work picking apples off the ground. <laughs> okay, I still kind of agree. A good start, but it needs more. No. <laughs> no. 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 <laughs> yes. I'd go with this one. No, this one! <laughs> wow, what's so funny? Something it's funny? What? Oh, no, uh, it's just, I mean, those belts look the same. Oh, well, that one completely changes the look. This one compliments they it. They do look they're the same. You're kidding, right? Is everything okay? They're having a heated debate about those two belts. Ooh, both good choices. No! There is no choice! <laughs> they're the exact same belt! Exactly! Oh, this is so silly! Fashion is ridiculous! Oh. oh! You don't mean that! I do! I'm sorry, but that's my honest opinion! <laughs> well, I never would have come if I knew we were going to be insulted! Uh, okay. Giggle! I go. No! Please, come back! If they're out, I'm out too. <laughs> I am. Uh... I didn't get into fashion to design boring utilitarian clothes. I want to create elegance and drama, and this is literally the opposite of. I mean, <coughs> I can't even. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No. I'm gonna go and put some more eyeshadow on. <laughs> what? I was just being honest. I, I, I again. I don't see anything wrong with this. Maybe I'm just honest as well. <laughs> it is the opposite of okay. The judges have quit. The designers have dropped out. The show is cancelled. Oh, my good intentions squashed. Why? <laughs> and why? <laughs> Interesting. And it's all a 
Applejack. Stop. What? Why are you mad at yeah. me? I was just saying what I thought. Exactly. And isn't that <clears> why you wanted me to be a judge? For my honesty? Of course. But you said fashion is ridiculous. But it's my opinion. And I'm not gonna lie. Exactly. Oh. Come with me. Okay. I, <laughs> I open up. Strawberry sunrise. Stra this is Strawberry Apple sunrise. I was wondering if you could tell her how you feel about apples. Don't like them. What? Why? They're crunchy. They're sweet. They're delicious. <laughs> they're not strawberries. <laughs> I love this. You're right. Apples are better than strawberries. Only if by better you mean better at being disgusting. <laughs> You'd better apologize. Oh, I'm sorry that you actually bite into those tasteless, mealy, worm filled things. Oh, <laughs> I don't. What? Oh, she's got she's Applejack, why are you so angry? It's just Strawberry's honest opinion. What's wrong with that? <laughs> well, that's fine if she doesn't like them, but if she knew how hard we worked to make our apples perfect, maybe she wouldn't be so mean about it. And the penny drops. Oh, <laughs> oh boy. Doesn't feel so good, does it? <laughs> nope. No, it does not at all. <sighs> I am so sorry, Rarity. I got so carried away with being honest, I guess I didn't think about how I was making others feel. <sighs> I'm a real rotten man. <laughs> I appreciate that, Applejack. That means a lot. I just wish you'd realize it before you ruin the fashion show. <laughs> okay, wow. No I face your ponies. These. It's the only way to travel. <laughs> ah! Where are your ponies? <laughs> You've been hijacked. Canterlot is that way. Yep, but you're not going back to Canterlot yet. Hey! Uh oh. What is she? Oh, I don't know. Run. <laughs> Run. <laughs> oh my god. You're gonna force to be lasso him in. <laughs> Listen, y'all. I thought I was just being honest when I said all those things. But some pony helped me realize I was actually <clears throat> being hurtful. So for that, I apologize. So, you don't think fashion is ridiculous? <laughs> uh, well, I, uh, I still don't understand it. But I appreciate how much it means to y'all. <laughs> yeah. And how much hard work you put into it. I also know this contest is important to Rarity. So, what do you say? Well, I'd hate to have come all this way here and not see what you can do. Yeah. If they're judging, we're in. Under one condition. What's that? Literally. Anything. Untie us. <laughs> <laughs> she and Maud would get along very well. Oh, you're going to have to rebuild it now. Show's back on, fellas! <laughs> Why are you so surprised? <laughs> Same thing, just different colour. <laughs> he didn't even know she was being distracted. This was all coming Oops. down. You can thank Applejack. She literally did it all by herself. <laughs> literally. I don't think that word means what you think it means. But I did bust my tail because I know how much this means to you. Oh. Oh. Thank you, Applejack. Be start now. Oh. <laughs> okay. First oh, bum, bum. Star streak. Oh. Pose, pose, and pose. Inky Rose. Inky what? Oh wait, yeah, okay. Oh. And now it's time to vote. I am 
draw into the beauty and drama of I'd go for Inky Rose. And no pony does Because I wear a lot of black. Lace, so I vote for her. It means so much. And she her accent is annoying. Try a cat even. Oh. Uh, uh. Simplicity is the keynote of true elegance. That is why I vote for Inky Rose. Exactly. You've made me so happy. <laughs> Fashion is the art. I photo finish vote for starting. So what each? Wonderful to hear, darling. Well, it all comes down to you. Ah, now what? Can you believe it? After everything that <laughs> happened, Applejack is the deciding vote. Ah, this is so exciting! <laughs> so who are you going to choose? <laughs> All of them. Lily Lace's clothes go here. Inky Roses will go there. Yeah. Oh, she did pick all of them. Okay. Sorry, but I couldn't pick just one. They all did great, and in my opinion, they all deserve to win. And I agree. I told you your perspective would be beneficial. Is uh, this one of your new designs, Rarity? It's a. Uh, the form is reminiscent of. Uh, I mean, <laughs> it conjures up images uh, of. Uh, uh, yeah. Well, uh, uh, I mean, it's... oh that? No, I totally messed that one up. It's ghastly, horrid, absolutely terrible. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank goodness! Because in my honest opinion, it's awful. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay, <laughs> and I'm gonna end it there. So, um, yeah, episode about honesty. Everyone needs honesty, right? Or do they? Which we found out in this episode. But I will see you guys and girls in the next one.